day six of the College World Series here in Omaha, and the competition has been on fire all week long at Charles Schwab Field. But right across from the ballpark, right here at Rocco's Pizza and Cantina, there's a different type of competition, and they're also keeping score. And I'm like, you know, I think I can get some jello shots and get them in team colors, and we'll throw them up there, and we'll get a board up, and we'll, you know, kind of get this thing going a little. Arkansas winning games on the field in Omaha. Two-run shot, 8 nothing. Arkansas rolling. And at the bar. I put the plaque up above it and thought, hey, maybe somebody will you know, try to get to 3,000, maybe chase that record a little. And then I end up with, you know, Ole Miss and Arkansas. And then it just kind of spirals from there. Razorback fans beat the previous record held by Mississippi State by the third night of competition. And they're continuing to rack up the numbers. Yeah, we bought two bu two bu 10 buckets, which is like... 200 jello shots. So how many jello shots are you guys taking tonight? As many as we can handle. With how much success Rocco's has had with hog fans, restaurant owner Kevin Coljet is deciding to give back to the Razorback community. Taking $2 from every jello shot consumed by hog fans and donating that to the Full Circle Food Pantry at the University of Arkansas. When you start having people buy them 200, 300, 500, 1,000 at a time, you know, I realized we had a much bigger deal on our hands. My wife and I just felt like, hey, there's, you know, we need to do something and help these people out. Coljat says he's been so busy, he hasn't reached out to the food pantry yet, but is excited to give them a big donation after the tournament. We write a couple really big checks to a couple really good, you know, good, good organizations here at the end of the series. And thanks to the energy from the Razorback faithful this week, the Hogs have earned themselves at least one more fan. Woo pig suey, baby. <laughs> Arkansas fans have certainly made their mark on the scoreboard in there at Rocco's. They're hoping the baseball team can continue to do the same on the scoreboard at the stadium. Reporting in Omaha, Jonathan Acosta, 5 News Sports.